Hey, what's happening, guys? I'm the Stereo Cat Gamer. Welcome back to Prey. Um, now, this is <coughs> new, isn't it? Please come on a PlayStation game. Because I finally decided to start setting things up. By the way, if you're not seeing this face cam, that means I got lazy or what I planned didn't work. So, this probably all doesn't make sense if it didn't work. If it's working, hi! So, picking up where we left off, and we are heading towards Alex's office. I don't have to come in here, but <clears throat> just doing a supply check. A little nosy down here. Read it's attention here and bot. Because they had to I used to get up there. Oh, good. No sigh at all. Oh, 
Bloody cats. Good evening, Talos. Registration for the Talos Employees Talent Show is now open. See Galen in the crew quarters front desk to reserve a slot. Who spotted? That's so cool. This idea must have been so amazing when I think was how it should be before the typhoon or whatever, the typhoids. I don't fucking know what they're called. Your only option is to escape. 
get the word out about what's happening on Talos 1. Alex has a private escape pod. It's locked up. I made a copy of the key and hid it on top of the data tower near the chair. You know the one I'm talking about. Listen, there's more at stake this time than just us. Or this station. If just one of those creatures made it back home, then we're lost. I keep having this... dream. I'm just staring into the black between the stars. There's something there. I know there is. I just can't see it. But it sees me. I can feel it. Hate us. I know you know what I'm talking about. Or you will soon. I was forget that I technically do have a voice actor. Despite the fact that the character themselves are mute. And that January is also the same voice. Don't know how you expect me to hack into this, I'm not that high. My name is Morgan Yu. Year is 2035. I'm aboard the Talos One research facility. Ooh, hi. Wait, <coughs> Why are we making this video? Right. Because my big brother is paranoid. Psychometric data is showing statistically significant variance in personality patterns between trial runs of the new neuromods. Whatever. I feel more like myself than ever. I mean, look at this. We did it, Alex. It's real. Enjoy it while you can, because in a few minutes, it'll all be gone, and we strip out the neuromods and we set. I know, I'm including my memory of it. No way around it. Let's talk about the backup. So, the Typhon organisms have been producing an elaborate structure. Material is unknown, purpose unknown. My gut tells me it's kind of a neural framework, but externalized. Still waiting on analysis to confirm. In the meantime, I've given Alex the design for a device I think could shut it down, if it ever broke containment. Alex just has to grow a pair and commit. You don't have to take all the credit. What if it doesn't work? It'll work. Trust me. What else are we going to do? Blow everything up? <laughs> that won't save us. And if it does work, is it worth it? The people that come after us will be smarter, stronger, immortal. They can judge us if they want. But they'll know they exist because of the things we did. I'm ready. Do it. Well, there you have it. Everything I've done is what you've asked me to do. I didn't think you'd believe me unless you heard it from your own mouth. The tests. They changed you. Not a lot at first, but eventually, the constant stripping of your memory. I didn't know who you were anymore. All I want is to have my sister back so we can finish what we started. The device you mentioned is an advanced version of the Null Wave. It's the only way to stop the Typhoon without destroying everything we've been working toward. We're just missing some scan data from the Carl to complete the design. Help me finish this, Morgan. And then, you can have my arming key. I don't believe you want to use it anymore, but you can have it. I left a chip set for you on my desk. You'll need to upgrade your psychoscope to scan the Carl. I'll send you the scan locations.
have a friend by that same name as well, Emma Beatty. Good evening, Talos. A word from our security chief, Ms. Alizar. To protect your co-workers' privacy, security terminals are reserved for authorized uses only. If you're not wearing a blue uniform, you're probably not authorized. Morgan, that video was... I'm still checking it against my directives. But if scanning the coral will grant you access to Alex's arming key, then perhaps it's the best course. Perhaps knowing the Coral's purpose will reinforce your decision to destroy Talos-1. Just be careful. We're running out of time. Well, it's just like an escape pod. What's time? 17 minutes. See, when it said extend the bridge, I thought it might have extended the bridge from Alex's office to about there or something. So I didn't have to walk all that way. <coughs> What did I just tag? What is the coral? Doing this for coral. God, I've got a pain in the neck. I actually haven't been this way yet.
Who is it? <coughs> oh, my voice done. Twenty-two minutes. Oh fuck! It's a lot of times it's a fucking bitch, isn't it? that version of you is the true Morgan, but why? Just because it came first? If someone had made you, then I suppose your truest self would be the one that fulfills whatever purpose your maker intended. I know who made me. Why? Did someone make you, Morgan? Were you made for something? If not, you'll have to invent your own purpose, or have none at all. Strangely, of all the things I know about you, I don't know what you believe. You have to decide, Morgan. Who are you? What the hell am I supposed to do about this?
showed you. Your brother believes that version of you is the true Morgan, but why? Just because it came first? If someone had made you, then I suppose your truest self would be the one that fulfills whatever purpose your maker intended. I know who made me, and why. Did someone make you, Morgan? Were you made for something? If not, you'll have to invent your own purpose, or have none at all. Strangely, of all the things I know about you, I don't know what you believe. You have to decide, Morgan. Who are you? Warning. Vital signs critical. Loads of potassium. I don't want to alarm you, but there's been a launch from the Argus platform. Board of Directors has caught wind of the situation here. I suppose it was inevitable despite my efforts. That's why it's important we act quickly, decisively. They'll try to take this out of our hands, Morgan. I need to sort something about these fucking It's a kind of 
neural structure. Synaptic like activity up and down the length of it like it. Communicating. Just one more to go. I knew you could handle this. Our father warned me not to stake so much of the company's future on your ideas. I was right to ignore him. We're a good team, Morgan. Oh, I really need to stop doing that. That is so slow and taking time. Half an hour. How the hell do I get in? Maybe it is inside the ship. Suit integrity damaged. <laughs> Fuck.
Oh, for fuck's sake, so I've got to go back out. They told me to project fucking back in here. No, so it's just in the same fucking place, isn't it? After all that fucking asking about. Just did be fucking airplane. I've been nothing quiet all day today. As soon as I start doing a fucking recording, that's it. Fucking World War 3 bricks out outside the fucking window. <laughs> Ah, 
That is really disorientating. I hate that. It gives me proper headache. I can't stop looking at my fucking hair. It looks horrendous on this camera. Should I say ginger? Or should I go bright red? Forty-five minutes. Probably the probably best time to leave it now, isn't it? So let's start doing this outro then. <clears throat> Thanks so much guys for watching this episode. If you liked this episode, and bitch slap that like button, maybe and subscribe, and I shall see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye. Let's just get the thingy. Ah, fuck it. Bye.